So today I'm talking about a P2177 code, what it is and how you could go about fixing it. And so what is a P2177 code? Well, it's a system to lean off idle bank one. And so what does this mean? Well, basically there's what's called oxygen sensors and they're located down the exhaust and they do two things. The first thing they do is they monitor the catalytic converter and the second thing they do is they monitor how much oxygen was burnt off during combustion. And the computer uses that information to adjust the air fuel ratio mixture that's going into the cylinders. But when you get this P2177 code, this bank one sensor 102 sensor is reporting back to the computer that the engine's running lean for some reason, which means that the air fuel ratio mixture is off. There's more air going into the engine than should be. So it's going to be troubleshooted to know why. And if you have a V6 or V8 engine, the engine's going to have two banks. Bank one side of the engine is always the side of the engine with the number one cylinder. So if you Google your engine and like firing order or cylinder location or something like that, and you locate the number one cylinder, since there is differences between engines, then that side of the engine is going to be bank one, and the opposite of that would be bank two. And one thing to note about this P2177 code is that sometimes it can be kind of difficult to troubleshoot because it can be caused by so many different things. So be sure to keep that in mind. Also, if you're getting any other codes, be sure to pay attention to that because that can help point you to what the problem is. And so what are some possible causes of a P2177 code? Well, the first thing that can cause this is a bad Bank 1 Sensor 102 sensor. That sensor might have just gone bad and be reporting bad information back to the computer. So the computer just thinks there's a problem when there isn't. There's some different ways to go about testing these sensors. There's some good YouTube videos on that. I've made YouTube videos on this. I'll put a link down below in the description box below if you need to check that out. And the basics of what's going on with these O2 sensors is that there's going to be two on each bank of the engine. Sensor one is going to be located before the catalytic converter, and it's also called the upstream O2 sensor. And sensor two is going to be located after the catalytic converter, sometimes right on it, and it's also called the downstream O2 sensor. Sensor two is mainly helping to monitor the catalytic converter. So the main sensor to go and check when you get this P2177 code is going to be this bank one sensor one O2 sensor. And the next thing that could cause this is an exhaust leak. And basically, if there's an exhaust leak, then air can be getting into the exhaust and it's causing those O2 sensors to get a bad reading. It's just throwing everything off. So be sure to be on the lookout for any kind of exhaust leak because if there is, then that can cause problems. And the next thing that could cause this is that the engine is running lean for some reason. And this is where it can be kind of difficult to troubleshoot. So the first thing to do is to pay attention to any other codes you might be getting. So for example, if you also got like a P2296 code, fuel pressure regulator two, control circuit high, then in that case, it's a good idea to go do some tests on that fuel pressure regulator because very likely it's gone bad or there's some kind of issue there that's just throwing everything off and causing the engine to run lean. If you have a V6 or V8 engine, then pay attention to whether or not you're getting any codes on bank two. Because if you are getting lean codes on bank two, then that would point to something that would affect the whole engine. But if you're only getting lean codes on bank one, then that would only be something that would affect bank one. For example, if you also got like a P0174 system to lean bank two, then in that case, it's very likely something that would affect the whole engine. So that would be something like a weak fuel pump, a clogged fuel filter, a bad sensor, something along those lines. But if you are only getting codes for one bank of the engine, then that would point to something that would only affect that side of the engine. So that would be something like a bad injector or something along those lines. If you're not getting any other codes, or if you're having problems trying to figure out if the engine is running lean, or which cylinders are running lean, or things along those lines, you can remove the spark plugs one at a time, and then check to see how the tip is burning, and then match them to a spark plug burn chart to check to see if one or more cylinders is running lean because you can't check to see how the cylinder is burning by checking to see how the spark plug is burning. But the last thing that's gonna cause this is that the engine is running lean on bank one side of the engine. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to give a basic overview of how you go about fixing a vehicle with the P2177 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me, I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe and have a good day.